Okay. Let's take a over here if you want to live. Watch out for the mine. A quick, they're coming. Okay. She sounds like a friendly. She said watch out for mines. Oh, here we go. Lock and load. They'll be here any second. Who are you talking about, lady? Oh! I've got oh, oh, shit! Welcome back, everybody, to Fallout on the Tale of Two Wastelands Overhaul with the Capital Punishment mod list. I am the Bearded OG, and we're picking up right where we left off. Um, and we are on our way next to the National Archives to find the Declaration of Independence for what's-his-name down in um, Rivet City. And we also need to go to the Washington Monument and mount up this satellite dish that we found. So... So, let's go ahead and uh, put these on. And we have a bunch of mutants all over out here. So we're going to have, I, I believe the archive is over that way. Yeah, pretty much right over that way. So maybe what we do is we make our way around this direction and try and... Avoid the mutants as much as possible. I mean, I can kill them, but they can kill me too. <laughs> For sure they can. And I, you know, I want to kind of conserve ammo. So we'll just work our way around this way and see if we can get over there without being detected or at least with minimal encounters. What time is it? It's about 2.30 in the morning. Okay. Oh, shit. What the hell's going on over there? I wonder if the Brotherhood's fighting them. We got robots. Oh, those are talons. Oh, good. Okay. Soften those fuckers up. Because they're going to come after me. We'll just let this play out. And if the talons, even if they do win, they're going to be softened up quite a bit. They even got a robot attacking them, too. Maybe they'll drop another really good weapon for us. Okay, so they killed one super mutant. Let's move in a little closer here. Th those bastards just attacked me. <laughs> it seems like, man, they are relentless. Oh, is that, is that robot on their, on their team? Okay. All right, the robot's down. Let's take this guy out here. Okay, he's down. I see... Two mutants and I guess that's another mutant up oh shit, they're all over the place. Okay. Uh I'm gonna say that the battle's oh, well, no, there's another talon right there. Okay, he's down. Let's let those guys bugger off. 
So that's way too many of them for us to try and take on. And then we'll go um, loot the Talons. It is nice of them to provide a delivery service to us. For potentially good weapons and decent enough armor to sell and make some coin. Let's take him out. Oh, no, nope, he's not staying there. I need those guys to bugger off. Well, we might have to deal with them too. Let's um Let's put a frag mine down here a little ways. I don't want to attack uh, or attract rather anybody's attention from it over there though. It's a thing. Okay, he's down. Okay, let's move in. Yeah, we either we're either gonna have to eliminate those those two that are still patrolling or wait till they completely disappear. And I'm starting to think maybe they won't completely disappear. Alright, that's a well I don't know if we can shoot through chain link in this game. I think we can. Man, they're all over up there, too. Game oh, shit. I never even saw those guys. All right. Man, they're coming. Damn it. No fucking action points. Okay. Are they still following me? They're on alert, but they're not actually following me. Not yet. Okay, here's what we're going to do. Let's put uh, a frag here. Okay, let's get you out. Where'd they go? Did they run back? I'll take him out just because I don't want him being one of the guys that comes after us later. Oh, they're moving way back over that way. Okay. Hold still just a minute right there, buddy. Maybe we can work with this. Oh, shit. Okay. There's one right. We're near the door, right? Okay. So far, so good. Um, I think it's time for us to take these off. And this would be a good place to do a save, too. <laughs> All right. Let's advance. Be careful, though. I really should put those on my hot bar. I use them so much, you know. In fact, I use these more than even frags. Where would I put them? Let's put them in five, because I don't use my cowboy repeater a lot. So that way we can just hit five and throw one down while we're running away kind of thing. Okay. Apologies for that flashing texture thing. That's been a problem with my save ever since we started this. That's the fucker that killed us. Uh, before. He's still there too? Okay. Oh, 
Oh, he moved right when I pulled the trigger. Okay, now he's dead. We're in danger from something somewhere. Okay, it's back to caution. Okay, back to caution. Beautiful. We're thinning these fuckers out. Okay. I don't know if I want to go down there because I still think there's more pats. Maybe we'll go try and get down there to loot those guys later but let's let's get back over here all right I've got a caution from something nope not taking a rebar club all right I see one up through here that's the one I have a bunch of branches in the way. Okay, we got him. Good. Where's the capital? Okay, there's one of the talons, and his armor's in pretty good shape. And we killed the other two, because obviously I can't vaporize anybody with my weapons. Let's do a quick save right here. Wow, look at all the stuff he's got. Good gravy. More night vision goggles. Are they the same as what we already have? Okay. You know what we could do is... Oh, no, we can't. Never mind. I was going to say, maybe we could repair those with the others, but... We don't have the skill... Homemade shark shotgun. That's pretty pretty low in oh, I've discovered the Capitol building. Pretty low in weaponry for Talon Company. There's a, a mole hole. All right, let's loot this guy. And we're back to being encumbered. Of course we are. This robot might have some scrap electronics. Nope, it doesn't. Scrap metal, though. That's good, too. What I'm actually thinking about maybe doing is use, oh, there's a guy, is using that mole hole and traveling back home to dump some of this shit off. But if we're going to do that, we got to clear the area. Got to caution. Oh, shit. Ow. I can't run because I'm encumbered. I gotta get out of his line of sight so he comes after me.
Ah, shit. Here comes another one. I can't move. Right, is he coming? Did we actually kill him? Can't believe he gave up that soon. Alright, let's top off here. We'll take an antiseptic and a bandage. My ability to retreat is severely hampered because of being encumbered. Okay, we want five for a frag. Frag mine, that is. That guy must have gone back. Because there was no reason for it. Oh. Oh, I think that's the one we shot earlier. Okay. <clears throat> I see a dude up there. And there's a guy there, too. Okay, he might have just... Well, he saw something. Alright, we got him. I saw one... Um, Patton right up there earlier. There he is. Let's pick that up. One thing we have to keep in mind if we use this mole hole in the future, it's going to put us in a really hot spot because these guys will repop at some point, most likely. I think we'll go into the Capitol building right now. Police submachine gun. Okay, that seems to be clear over that way. Not seeing anything over here. Okay. Call into the mole hole. Megaton. 147 caps. Let's do it. All right, guys. So I'm going to sell, repair, rest. Uh, oh, we need the level two. And I also have a metric butt ton of stuff. Welcome to Megaton. In the Pony Express here that we've shipped here from uh, Rivet okay. City. My equipment has been returned. All right. Close box. Ship to Rivet City. Okay. Thirsty Let's see, what time partner. is it? It's 4.30 p.m. Drinks in the capital wasteland. Let's go home first and we'll do most of our selling and stuff there. And I'm also going to sleep. Well, 
You know what, though? Maybe we should sell here first while the vendors are still open. I don't think the price prices make any difference. Plus, I've got so much stuff, it's not likely any of them are going to have enough caps to buy all my stuff anyway. I'm not going to actually turn in the quest to her, though. Any luck finding out how Rivet City got started? Um... I can't get a straight answer to those folks. Try asking around a bit. You never know who's collected a lot of information, do you? Okay. Oh, shit. I always forget. Let's get our selling uh, trader outfit on first. Okay. How's it going out there in the waste? What do you got for sure sale? Thing. She has 442 caps. Okay. So let's let's just start offloading armor first. The the vendors in Is that in better shape than my car? Uh, not really. Okay. And in my base, um, usually have a, a lot more money. I might hang on to those just so we can, once we do get high enough in repair, we can use them to repair these. Okay, let's accept that. I don't have any Raider armor on me. I guess I must have sold all that in, in Rivet City. You can have the rad roach meat and all of the pre-war food. We're going to keep the Mirelark stuff. Let's sell the beer and the whiskey too. Only have two dirty waters. Okay. Most of the stuff that I have is weapons. Sell the pre-war money. We shouldn't have any junk because I wouldn't have sent that back. Okay, so... Let's just start selling weapons until she runs out of money. We'll need some machine gun. Nah. There's another marksman carbine. Oh, she's already out of money. Okay. What we'll do here then is buy ammo from her. I will take any th 308s that you have. Oh, you don't... Moira, what the hell? I don't got much going on. I'll take your pulse slugs for your 20 gauge. Um, I guess we'll take some 357s just to T fix that. We'll take some tins. We're not using 12 gauge. We'll take the 20s. Good lord, what do we sell to her? Oh, we're, we're almost there. She has 222. We just need to get 10 more out of her. Uh, I guess we could take the 44 magnum rounds. Because we do have some 44 magnums. Okay, accept that. Now, what we could also do is have her repair. That's right, we got this minigun. She can repair the more damaged night vision goggles. A police submachine gun. Yeah, see, I'm gonna sell all this stuff, so I don't want I don't want to spend money to repair it. It just kind of doesn't make sense to do that. All right. Um, I want to look at this police submachine gun. Uses ten mils. It's okay, I suppose. But I think we'll sell it. 
I don't think I'm going to pay Walter 70 caps just to purify two dirty water. Um, plus, I have a bunch of purified water already anyways. Good to see you. It's good to see you too. Uh, do we have any major ill effects? Do we need to go see the doctor? I mean, our radiation still isn't that high. We really don't. I don't think we need to go spend money with the doc. Okay, let's go sell the rest of these weapons at my place. Doc Hoff. Here to see the good doctor? I am. That Why don't you repair a wasteland backpack? And our Navy combat armor. And that's really all I want you to repair. Man, it feels like we haven't been home in forever. Let's pick our replenishing mutt, mutt fruit or mute fruits. I think actually it might be called, pronounced mute, mute fruit. I've heard it called that. All right, let's uh, sell the rest of this stuff off first. Yeah, see, they have 1146 caps. We're keeping the minigun. Um, that laser rifle has a lot of nice mods on it. I might hang on to it just in case we might want to try laser rifles or energy weapons at some point. I already have a Watts. Okay. Let's accept that. I will buy your 5.56 five, rounds. Uh, he doesn't, or they don't, rather, have any 308s, though, which kind of sucks. You know, at some point, we can start maybe thinking about buying some of these decorations. Ooh, a 10 millimeter pistol extended magazine. Let's buy that for our 10 mil. H&K MP9 compensator. Uh, I'll buy any primers that you have. A wonder glue. Okay. All right, so we're sitting at 2268 caps. That's the most caps we've had so far in this playthrough. Uh, what do we want to do next? Let's, what time is it? It's 618. Okay, I'm going to wait a little bit longer before we sleep. Let's go down here and see if we can plant these seeds. Oh, you know what? I bet you we have to use the workbench to do something with them now that I think about it. Uh, Springvale plant hydroponics. We need... Oh! Okay. We need fertile soil. Where do we get that? Did we miss that at Rivet City? And we have to find a laboratory or chemistry supplies. And we have to find crafted infirmary hardware and infirmary firmware upgrades. Yeah, there... We may have missed fertile soil back in the hydroponics bay because that's the only place that I know of in you know in Revit City that has that. So we'll have to go back there and look around again. I have no idea where this stuff is. We'll have to read through Hacksaw's journals again and see if we can get a clue. All right, I'm going to put uh, some ammo away and make some more ammunition, pri primarily 308s, I think. How are we doing on 556s, by the way? Armor piercing. We have 155, but 
We burned through those quite a bit, and I've got 414 normal, so I might turn, I might end up turning all of those into armor piercing. Because why not, right? Uh, so anyway, uh, let me get everything else put away, get some more ammo, you know, made and stuff, and then uh, I'll bring you back, and we will sleep and level. All right, guys, we are ready to sleep. Let's do it. It's 9.51 p.m. Um, we're going to take that mole hole back and that takes a few hours so let's wake up at say around 5 a.m you sleep soundly welcome to level 10 we have 11 skill points to assign all right so 55 on repair is where i wanted to get with that um i'd like to get Lock picking up to probably 50 to do normal locks That's at some point. But I think I want to just keep working on guns. And we use a lot of explosives, so we should probably pump that up too. So let's bump this up to 25. And then I'm going to, I think I'm going to put the rest in guns for now. Okay. And then back to this. We've got some, I think maybe a couple of new ones that I uh, have opened up. So let me look through these again. All right. I'm thinking about Stonewall. You gain 10, uh, plus 10 damage threshold against all melee weapons and unarmed attacks and cannot be knocked down. Um, we've been thumped pretty good a few times by... Um, uh, super, you know, melee wielding super mutants. Um, solitary soul is interesting. We basically recover 10% more health from healing and 15% more experience when we don't have a companion with us, which of course we haven't up to this point. That doesn't mean we won't later, but it could help us right now. Uh, if we get a non-fatal critical hit, it'll restore the hit's health damage by 2% per point of endurance. Um, so that's something to think about. And finesse, you have a higher chance to store a critical hit on an opponent in combat, equivalent to five extra points of luck. See, that's not bad either, really. Um, handgun hotshot perk grants a five damage threshold penetration to ballistic handguns and 15% attack speed with non-automatic ballistic handguns. That would make our, our snake lore 45 even more deadly than it already is. The second rank grants an additional 20% damage at the cost of increasing strength requirements by one. I think we already have strength seven, so we'd still be able to do that. The other one is just straight up toughness. This would give us a total of six, well, three for now, then another three uh, to DT just across the board. Um, all right. I think there's, there's a few good ones here for sure. Kind of like this idea, you know, the finesse perk. I think let's take that. Let's take finesse. Okay. Uh, wait, what? No. Uh, done. Here we go. Okay, cool. Achievement unlocked. New kid. Reach level 10. You've reached level 10 with positive karma. If you so choose, you may become a lawbringer, one of those who brings justice to the wastes. You will be able to turn in the fingers of evil characters to the regulators for caps and positive karma and accept contracts for fugitives and the lawless in the wasteland. Is that a mod thing or is that just part of the normal game? I don't remember this. I mean, I don't see why not. We are generally a pretty good guy for the most part. <laughs> Uh, I don't know who the regulators are, but I guess that will become obvious to us. Sure, why not? I don't see any reason not to do this, uh, for our character anyway. Uh, a map marker was just added, and a note about the regulators. Okay, so they're going to actually help us figure th figure that out. I read through Hacksaw's stuff again, and the only thing he says about soil is 
the soil that's already in our own hydroponics bay. And I went back down there again and I couldn't find anything that allowed me to pick up fertile soil. So yeah, I'm not sure what's on, up with that. Scum Pestilence, report to Sonora Cruz at the Regulator Headquarters for details. Regulator Headquarters. Um, do we have a quest for that? I don't see an actual quest for it. So I guess we'll have to figure out where the regulators are. Okay. Anyway, let's head on back out. Oh, I want to actually get a little bit of sustenance here. We're not in bad shape, but uh, we might as well top off whilst we're here. We're going to just keep our radiation where it is for now. Um, so we just need 119 food and 219 hydration. Do I have food on me already? Oh, I do. Okay. The Mirelurk special will give us 158 food. Two of these will give us 100 water and about 158 food. All right, let's just eat two of these then. And then I'm going to take, let's take four purified water. I'm going to put all of that there. We have the MREs for emergencies. We'll put the Nuka Cola in there too. That's pretty good. I think we'll hang on to, those are a pound of pop. Let's put uh, one of them back. All right, we are in very good condition. We do have some some kind of hurt limbs. Hmm. I wonder if I should go actually have the doc fix us up for that. I mean, we have we've got plenty of cash now. Yeah, maybe we will. All right, guys. Uh, Lucky Harith is. Um, outside of Megaton, and he, his repair skill is now 91. So let's uh, take advantage of that and just get all of our stuff in tip-top condition here. Uh, we don't need to repair that, but we definitely want to repair that. Cool. His MD-308s. We're, we're in pretty damn good shape on all other ammunition. Just looking to see what kind of mods he has here. Um, I will buy those large pistol primers from you. Thanks. Keep your. Okay. I uh. I just realized that. I don't know where the mole hole is in Megaton. It when we when we came back. It popped me out right about here. Water. Good to see you. Is it a situation you where it doesn't have its own, you can go to it, but you can't go from it kind of thing? That seems kind of odd. I'm just going to look around and see if I can spot it. it. It's pretty obvious when you're near it because it's got the green smoke, you know? We might have to, it's just a mole rat. I mean, it wouldn't, oh shit, there's mole rats all over out here. It wouldn't make sense for, um, God damn it. I just got diseased. It wouldn't make sense for it to, be way behind Megaton, I wouldn't think. So yeah, I I guess I just never paid attention to that before. Hmm. 
Weird. Boy, you're good. All right. Well, now. 75 caps. Here. How attached to your fingers would you say that you are? Oh, wait. Never mind. There it is. All better now, you bitch. Should we just get our radiation healed too? Let's. What's that cost? A hundred? Sure yeah. can. Let's just do it. And a quick shot. All done. All right. So what we'll do is we'll just ride the robots' transport to the capital. Um, because I mean that's really our only option. I don't see another mole hole here. Or we go to Great Itch, but. Then we're going to have to pay to get to Great Edge and then pay to get to the capital. And I don't know if that's going to be cheaper or not. So let's just do this and get on with our life. Okay. Here we are. And uh, what we are going to do now is... We're going to go into the archives. Get our health topped off here. Man, that's kind of a dangerous spot to to land if we hadn't taken out all these mutants. Take a look at our map here. Alright, so the archives are... Probably that building right over there, I'm guessing. Okay, that's where we're headed there, I bet. Let's go loot these guys first. Okay, let's do a save. And into the archives we go. Terminal there. Okay, we'll go down there in a bit. National Archives guess and win. Prize Redemption Terminal. Question one. The Declaration of Independence was an act of what body? Second Judgment Mental Congress. Answer all eight questions correctly and win. Question, uh, incorrect? Wait, what? I thought that's what it was. Apparently not. Incorrect, please play again. Uh, First Continental Congress? What? Okay, now we're just guessing. There we go. Second Continental Congress. How many North American colonies rebelled against the in Great Britain in 1776? 13. Uh, question three. Who was the first person to sign the Declaration of Independence? Uh, <clears throat> what's 
Wasn't it Ben Franklin? Okay, no. Was it John Hancock? Oh yeah, that's why... That's why we use the term sometimes, you're John Hancock when you need a signature. Question four. How many del delegates signed the Declaration of Independence? 76. No? The following is not a written section of the Declaration of Independence. Indictment, preamble, introduction, ratification, indictment. What? Okay. Obviously, I didn't pay much attention in history, <laughs> in U.S. history class. Oh, well. Okay. Let's take a look. Okay. She sounds like a friendly. She said, watch out for mines. Oh, here we go. We need to actually kind of replenish some of our mines. So, here we go. Lock and load. They'll be here any second. Who are you talking about, lady? Oh! I've got oh shit! Hang tight. There's always a second wave. Oh, you're not shitting me. Uh, get away! Get away! Wow, okay. I thought we were doing really good there. They must he must have got a lucky headshot off on us or something. Whew. Okay, let's uh let's try that again. Uh I should probably I probably shouldn't be picking the, those mines up because they're coming. Okay. Lock and load, they'll be here any second. Hey! Where? What do you mean, where? You can't see them coming? Found you. Incoming. Oh, now the game. God damn it. We were doing good that time, too. Get back over here if you want to live. Okay, I'm coming. Lock and load. They'll be here any second. I'm locked and loaded. Incoming! Hang tight. There's always a second wave. Is she? Oh, she's the one that's doing that. Game's over! Look out! Are you the one that threw that big plasma grenade? Okay. Sydney. Oh. What the fuck? Get your ass over here if you want to live. Lock and load. They'll be here any second. Completed. Defend the rotunda. Okay, do a quick save. So we don't have to do this fucking thing like a fourth time. Uh, uh, no, not pickpocket. Let's talk to Sydney. Whew. Say, you're pretty decent in a firefight. Well, thank you very much. Um, yep, I sure am. Yeah, better than you did. I, <laughs> I don't know that she did a whole lot. I'm assuming she threw the plasma gra grenade, so that had to have helped. So let's just be nice here. Well, with what I do for a living, you need to be. 
Sorry, I'm being a complete asshole. I'm Sydney. It's good to meet a fellow relic hunter. A relic hunter? Yeah, I guess I am kind of hunting relics, aren't I? Because I'm after the Declaration of Independence. Um, what do you mean, fellow relic hunter? Come on. You and I both know this is where the Declaration of Independence is stashed. No need to be coy about it. I wasn't really meaning it that way. Good old Abraham Washington sent you on the same suicide oh, mission yep. he sent me on. He sure did. The only problem is, you're not going to get it without my help. Okay. Who's stupid enough to shell out a bunch of caps for a scrap of paper? I don't work with strangers. What are you proposing? Hang on there. You tell me who you are before I agree to anything. Uh, well, she did. She told me she's Sydney and she's a relic hunter. I mean, that's not a lot to go on, but what are you proposing? Simple. We pool our resources, grab the declaration, then make for Rivet City and split the reward. Are you going to double cross me? I've studied the plans of this place. So without me, you are going to go in circles. What do you say? Um. Uh. All right. That sounds good to me, I guess. Just don't be stupid and get yourself killed, okay? Smart move. And if you double cross me, you are dead. D E A D dead. Okay. Okay. The declaration is secured in the archive's strong room underground. Okay. There's a concealed cargo lift right here in the center of the rotunda. I've spent a few days hacking the lock with my remote terminal. When you're ready, punch in the password. Let's get going. Okay. Um. Yeah, since we're partners, can you tell me a little more about yourself? <laughs> I'm surprised that you care. Usually everyone looks out for themselves nowadays. What is it you want to know? Um... What happened to your father? Why would I ask her about what happened to her father? Uh, how, do, how did you get into the relic hunting business? I don't know. I grew up like pretty much every other girl in this crappy world. Spent most of my life just trying to keep away from slavers. Okay. One day out in the wastes, I stumbled across some poor bastard's body. On the body, I found info leading to some famous document. I had heard that Abraham Washington was looking for these scraps of paper. So I went after the thing. Turned out to be the Constitution. Interesting. After he loaded me up with caps, I got pissed drunk, got laid, and was happy for the first time <laughs> in a while. Okay, good for you. I haven't looked back since. All right. Um... You recovered all the stuff in the Preservation Society's museum? Oh, no. There is more than a lifetime supply of grade-A crap in that place. <laughs> Couldn't possibly do it alone. Like you, he hires anyone off the street. Yeah, okay. Honestly, I don't care what he does with that stuff. As long as the caps keep flowing, I'll be there to collect. I like your helmet, too, by the way. Um, nice gun. Never seen one like that. Yeah, it is nice. I don't even sleep without it under my pillow. I didn't really notice what kind of gun she has, but... My father made gun ammunition for a living. Taught me everything about how firearms work. That's good to have that inf uh, that knowledge in this world. So, I've spent my downtime tinkering with guns like my 10mm Ultra SMG here. It's like a hobby, I guess. Nice. 10mm Ultra SMG. I like it. Uh, what happened to your dad? Sorry. There's some things I still want to keep to myself. Maybe when I get to trust you better. Okay, so that's why it asked me about her dad, because if, if you go down in sequence, then she mentions him. Okay, I got you. Um, let me ask you something else. Okay. Are you hurt? Nope, I'm fine. Okay, good. Um, what do you know about the declaration? All I know is that it looks like a rolled up piece of thick paper with all kinds of writing on it. Some famous document from a long time ago. Abraham Washington is a huge U.S. history nut. So, that's why he wants it so badly. Gotcha. Okay. Um, what's our next move? There's a cargo lift right here in the rotunda. It should take us directly down to the lower levels. I was hacking the system right before we were attacked. The code should be, we the people. Oh. <laughs> yeah, that's a really secure password for, uh, for the National Archives. Uh, all right. Well, okay. I got your back. Let's get going. Um, so, 
we have ourselves our first companion. How about that? I wonder if I can get her to carry stuff. Oh, we gotta watch out for landmines. What if I can get her to carry stuff? What's up? Um. Okay, guess not. Stay are you gonna like punch super mutants or use your ultra SMG? Okay, let's carefully get these. Sydney, don't step on landmines. I'm a professional landmine grabber. I don't know if you are or not. Grenade launcher. Let's put our light on. That might help. Completely forgot about my light. It's been a little hectic so far in this place. Okay, before we take your elevator town, I want to just explore some of these side rooms. Hope she doesn't get herself killed. That's that's always the problem with the followers in these games. They, you know, they just run out willy nilly and they don't have much stealth or tactic, tactical ability. Take all of that stuff. That's good stuff. We need that for weapon. Oh shit! Weapon repair kits. Help me! Help you? Well, don't. Don't just run out there and try and punch him. Get your weapon out. What do you think you're doing? What do you mean, what do you think I'm doing? I'm looting. That's what we do. That's how we do. Well, all right, 308s. My favorite ammo. Or my favorite sniper rifle. I'm guessing she's part of the normal game because, you know, the whole Abraham Washington quest is part of the normal game the vanilla game so i just don't remember her but again i don't remember a lot of things about when i played this game like what 15 years ago or <laughs> however long it's been i am enjoying it though hope you guys are enjoying the series so far too i'm i'm very much low looking forward to getting to new vegas because i just adore new vegas it's my favorite fallout game even more than four so i'm looking forward to you know when we get going with that but you know i don't want to rush through Fallout 3 either. Okay, I hear footsteps over here. What the hell is that noise? Sounds like somebody doing some really sloppy eating. I smelled your fear! Oh! Getting jumpy, I guess. Sloppy eating, yeah, that uh, is what a cent centaur does. Well, let's do a couple of those and maybe just a normal bandage. Active pro oh shit! Damn. Sorry, did you get hurt? She got hurt a little bit, but not not too much. That's one of them booby trapped terminals. <laughs> Darts five five six. Twelve gauge. Take that. That. Pack of cigarettes. All right, where does this go? Elevator to archival strong room. Right, okay.
Did I check all of these filing cabinets? I think so. Cut it out. Cut what out? What the hell are you talking about? Why are you using a sledgehammer? Oh, whatever. Okay, that's going to go upstairs. I want to finish the ground floor first. We already came through here, right? Yeah. Let's go through this way. I think I hear another centaur. He must have thrown a, a grenade at me or I tripped a, maybe a, a grenade cocktail trap or something. Oh shit. We're all the way back here again. All right. Well, we need to, we need to wrap this episode up. So, um, we'll pick up right where we left off, uh, in the next episode. Uh, Why maybe I'll take a holodisc picture. It'll last longer. Don't be rude, Sydney. Uh, maybe what we'll do is uh, I'll clear that other room again first and then I'll start the. Uh, the episode from there so thanks everybody for watching hope you guys enjoyed this episode and if you did please hit that like button and subscribe to the channel leave a comment share the video and we'll catch y'all in the next episode Bye bye